सो हाई डियर पाइस अ वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू गाइस दिस इज अंजलि टैरो एंड दिस इज अ जर्नल लव रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द पाइस सन मून मीनस राइजिंग कीप इन माइंड दिस इज जर्नल इट माइट और माइट नॉट रेजोनेट विद द फर्स्ट प्लेस सेकंड थिंग द रोल्स कैन बी रिवर्स ऑल्सो थर्ड थिंग दिस इज अ रीडिंग फ्रॉम थर्ड टिल द नाइन्थ ऑफ अप्रैल सो लेट स्टार्ट योर पार्टनर्स करंट फीलिंग्स फॉर यू राइट नाउ आर लेट सी वंस लेट सी we have pisces we have the two of cups somebody feels a very deep soul mid level kind of connection with you it could it it is a person with whom you ended your things okay uh, there in some cases somebody knows that you are coming out of a breakup or separation and they are feeling some kind of soul mid kind of energy with you in some cases you ended things with somebody and they are feeling like this so let me clarify this but this there's something something related to ending or separation or breakup that's leading to the soulmate kind of uh, feeling uh, with someone uh, let's clarify the two of cups here cancer pisces scorpio energy <clears throat> we got the 9 of cups the temperance and the king of cups somebody feels like you are kind of a wish fulfillment for them and somebody is patiently waiting for the time when you are also going to be in love with them or you are also going to uh, have the same feelings for them somebody is patiently waiting for that time Wow, I think this is a new person or new energy, and uh, you got you met this person already, and they know that you are coming out of a very huge transforming, transformative phase of your life, uh, a breakup or something like this. So they know it. Somebody is patiently waiting for that energy of love and care from your side. Okay, hmm. let's see what this. Uh, let's see what do you feel about this person or the situation right now, Pisces. We have the Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. and sagittarius energy let's see what you feel judgment you are still in this energy of you know keeping your things to yourself thinking about a uh, a new future direction of your life having the wisdom having the knowledge about what the next to the next step should be for you right that kind of energy you are picking up so you are in this energy of forgiving and forgetting and starting to move on in your life or starting a new chapter in your life let's clarify the judgment in some cases maybe you are in this energy of giving second chance to somebody Let's see. Let's uh, clarify this. The justice, the two of swords, the queen of swords. Okay, you are feeling like you should bring balance in your life. Uh, you should bring uh, the balance back in your life. You are on the crossroad regarding a situation from a very long time, and now. you feel like you should come out of this crossroad situation and remain cold and off and detached toward the particular person or situation and move ahead in your life with forgiveness and kind of energy so all you want is a peace of mind all you want is a justice all you feel is like you should be at peace and all you feel like you should feel the balance within yourself first of all then only you can move ahead in your life and you feel like remaining cold and off and detached towards something or someone okay not giving any kind of signals or any kind of messages communication nothing let's see what this person wants from you what are their intentions for the situation ten of wands this person wants to drop this burden some kind of situation this person wants to have back and forth communication with you there is someone around you who wants to have a lot of conversation with you lots of messages communication with you because they just the, they just can can't let it go kind of cannot drop this let's clarify the ten of wands five of cups the hermit and the ten, three of swords so somebody definitely wants to talk to you wow somebody definitely wants to come the come out of this depression state of mind somebody wants to you know communicate with you somebody wants to be in this energy of healing the broken heart healing the pain that you guys are feeling both of you are feeling because of uh, somebody did something really wrong with you wow this there is a very high, heavy kind of burden some kind of situation going on between you guys right now one of you is deeply deeply wounded because of this situation especially this person they want to let go of this burden some kind of situation this heaviness this a uh, painful kind of situation let go of this pain and depression and they are thinking how to connect with you because they want to have uh, a lot of uh, clarification a lot of back and forth communication and they want to understand what actually is going on so that you guys can heal heal <clears throat> individually also and with each other also hmm it's deep rooted kind of feelings that is required in the situation <clears throat> let's see what do you want from this person or the situation right now
Eight of Pentacles. I think you are okay. You just want to remain detached and cold and off from the situation. First of all, I think you want to put in the effort and energy to make some kind of connection, work out with somebody else, or simply you want to put in the effort and energy in making your future uh, for, secure. You know. Let's clarify the Eight of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. You want to keep your future secure, hmm, financially secure. Let's clarify this. Money, job, career. The lovers, the five of swords and the page of swords. Yes, you are in this energy of giving up on lovers, like lovers around you or people around you. Or especially you are you are in this energy of deciding to, you know, taking a particular decade, taking a particular decision to give up on something or someone and watching them from a distance and meanwhile working on your own energies. In some cases you love somebody or you can say you like somebody or highly, highly attracted to somebody. But right now for the time being uh, you know that this is not the right time so that's why you are dropping this situation and watching them from a distance but you are in this energy of i will figure out a way to come back and work things out with you it could be very much possible that you're dealing with two energies at the same time the one that you like and the one that likes you and there is chaos going on between you guys right now hmm. that could be a possibility aries uh, sorry we have the gemini libra aquarius and we have gemini taurus virgo capricorn Let's see what's coming towards you till the 9th of April. Four of Swords. Hmm. Knight of Pentacles. Slowly but surely. Very, very slowly but surely. The, the uh, you can say, stable kind of energies are coming your way. Lots of healing is on the way for you. Lots of meditation, prayers and all this. Let's clarify. Four of Swords. What is happening? <clears throat> we got the Ace of Cups, the Strength card and the Seven of Cups. Somebody wants to come towards you. A new lover, a new person. It, 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 they want to come towards you. Somebody new is uh, like on the way. But they're holding back because they know either you have lots of options, you know, to uh, select from or it could be possible that they are having other options too. And that's why they are in this energy of like, uh, I will come back only when I will be very sure about the situation. Somebody's holding back their love for you. Somebody's holding back their emotions for you. Uh, again, they, they might be having this uh, like uh, impression that you are having lots of people around you or you are ha having lots of options around you. Why you are going to choose them? Or they are simply having other options too in their life and they want time and space to understand whether they really love you or not. Whether they should come towards you or not. So, period of silence but somebody is watching you. Somebody who loves you is holding back from you. Because of these reasons might be that I told you right now. Previously. Okay, let's see what is the guidance for your people. Pisces. <clears throat> The King of Pentacles, the Ten of Swords, the Six of Wands. See, Pisces, you have to understand when, when one door is closed, when one door is closing, the other is going to open up for you, right? So, so if some kind of marriage commitment or some kind of long-term partnership is ending for you, that means that that was not meant for you. Now you have to accept the ending, accept the truth, accept that uh, you cannot do anything about it. All you can do is to focus on the future, focus on the name, fame, success and victory about the future. Focus on being successful in the next ventures, the next things, the next relationships. So whatever is hurting you right now is actually creating space for something new in your life, something new and something better in your life. So you have to understand that you cannot control each and everything in your life and especially other people. Okay, few things are not in our hands, okay. So, uh, but if it is ending, it is happening for uh, our highest good. Now, after this ending, after this separation, or after whatever happened in your life right now, currently in the recent past, you have to understand that this is it. Start focusing on the now and then from now onwards, you are going to start focus on your name, fame and success. No looking back. That is the only solution that you are going to get success and victory. Learn the lessons, understand that you cannot change it, understand that you cannot control it and start focusing on something that's going to make you this successful and victorious in your life.
okay that is the story or guidance so thank you so much for tuning in pisces i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste